all in law this is a quick pediatrics and today we're gonna talk about sleep patterns in pediatric sleep patterns in pediatrics pediatrics okay guys so this is uh, not an important topic for USMLD and for MRCPSH examination but try to remember for a clinical practice okay so let's talk briefly. I'm going to discuss more rather than writing over the screen. Is that remember the infant sleeps? Infants. Infant sleeps nearly 18 hours a day. Okay, with 50% in this, with 50% rapid eye movement. R E M. Okay, with 50% rapid eye movement sleep compared to an adult where the adult will have REM about 20% that's it of his sleep okay rest is with an REM right and the other important point in pediatrics sleep pattern is by age 4 months if they attend at the age of 4 months around the 4 months okay night time sleep becomes consolidated means night time sleep becomes consolidated okay remember all right yes and this around the age of three years okay around the age of three years um what do you call them sleep disorders begins that is known as parasomnias parasomnias okay guys Remember, hmm? you know nightmares that occurs in a REM sleep, the child awakens in the distress about a dream. Okay, night terror that occurs in NREM. Okay, nightmares occurs in REM sleep. This is really very important for your civil examination. And night terrors occur in NREM, non rapid eye movement. Okay, remember. The in NR no, what do you call it in uh, night terror the child appears awake and frightened but is not responsive that's very important he's awake and frightened but he's not responsive responsive okay and then is amnestic about the event the next morning it means you won't remember about what has happened that's really cool right then we have what is the sleep walking occurs in NREM sleep walking that is known as Somna embolism that's a sleep walking occurs in NREM stage. Okay, all right. Most common is around the four to ten, four to eight years. Around four to eight years, the child will have the features of what you call uh, sleep walking. Okay, this other one is known as a talking that during the sleep that is a somniloquy. Somniloquy. Okay, some like is very common throughout the life, sometimes accompanied with night terrors and sleepwalking. So these are the important sleep patterns for a pediatrics. Uh, okay guys, so thank you so much for watching this video. And please do not forget to subscribe and please do not forget to share our videos with your friends. Thank you so much. Take care.